We are now in the port of Hamburg, and we are on the bridge of Höga Rora. You know, it's the largest, most environmentally friendly car carrier ever built. Uh, it's also a start on, for us on our path to zero. Uh, the main engine of the ship is a MEDI engine, which means it's a dual fuel engine. It can burn fuel oil and it can burn uh, methane. Further advantage of this engine is that the methane slip, that means the amount of unburned methane in the exhaust gas is very, very low. It's negligible. And this is industry setting uh, very low and means that overall this engine is very environmentally friendly. Before we left Nantong in the shipyard, uh, some man, superintendent, came on board to teach us the operation, the safety procedures during maintenance. And also after we left the shipyard, they continued to assist us in terms of spare parts, in terms of maintenance. For the main engine itself, when we try to do inspection, it's a very clean scavenging port. Unlike in the conventional engine, when we open all the scavenging ports, we see some carbon deposits. It's very positive, actually, when we are burning fuel using the LNG compared to the conventional fuels. Actually, during changing over from LNG to diesel, it's very efficient and very seamless. In Hög Outliners, we have uh, operation of a fleet well, consisting of roughly 40 vessels. Uh, they have all engines, main engines from MIN. What was extremely important for us when we did the design of Hög Avrora, that was to make a vessel that can be converted in the same pace as the technology development. So uh, this vessel is built to last for 30, 40 years. And obviously we will see some uh, te technological development along the road. And this particular engine can be converted uh, to go on new fuels. When the technology is ready, we can easily convert the engines. It's an engine that is first the most modern engine you can get today, but is also prepared to take the next steps into zero carbon shipping.